Il dit ça, c'est Jésus qui est tourné. Bien les serrer tout Jésus-Christ là, soit c'est la fin à trouver. Et ça, il pense que ça me dans la tête. Moi. Moi même d'a penser est-ce que si c'est Jésus qui est tourné est-ce que m'a sauvé ou si bien est-ce que m'a perdu N'a pas ce pas me venir dire bon Dieu m'a pas perçu m'a si la moi t'a venir pour m'apprendre mais on c'est les grecs m'a bien ti mon yo petit ti mon yo trop bébé The magnitude 7.0 earthquake that devastated Haiti on January 12, 2010, damaged or destroyed nearly 190,000 homes, leaving 1.5 million in need of shelter. Displaced families crowd into urban tent cities, survive in their own makeshift shelters, or seek refuge in other parts of the country. Left exposed to a harsh tropical climate, Earthquake victims are left completely vulnerable to heavy rains during the hurricane season. We are not familiar with earthquake in Haiti. The last one was 240 years. No one knew that is going to happen on that day. Rich, poor, educated, non-educated person, the population was not prepared for that. Habitat for Humanity has worked in Haiti for 26 years, providing more than 2,000 Haitian families with housing solutions. This includes new homes, progressive building, as well as home improvements and repairs. In response to the 2010 earthquake, Habitat has expanded our efforts working to improve the lives of thousands. So we've set the goal of helping 50,000 families get back on a path to decent shelter. That's a, at least a quarter of a million people, which is, uh, depending on whose statistics, between a quarter and a fifth of the total need. So that would put Habitat in a position of, of doing enough to matter. And that's how, we, as we thought about it, what would be enough to really make a difference in rebuilding this country. Working with partners, Habitat has assembled and distributed more than 21,000 emergency shelter kits. Our housing solutions are tailored to meet the diverse needs of families. We have established five Habitat resource centers to provide access to a range of services, including assistance in securing land. Addressing Haiti's crippling unemployment, Habitat hires local citizens to rebuild their communities from the ground up. This enables an organic recovery to take root. Je me sens bien et ça fait moi après nos paquets de matériel que je me connais et qu'on est noyau également, qu'on est utilisation yo et qu'on est tout et il y a une connaissance plus large tout de ces des matériels que je me connais. Et de venir arriver choisi comme une colis de Addressing the immediate housing demand, we have built temporary transitional shelters that can be easily dismantled and relocated. More recently, Habitat is building upgradable shelters with wood walls and concrete perimeter foundations. This includes 2,000 in partnership with the American Red Cross. Partner families can eventually modify these shelters into permanent homes. <laughs> Habitat helps create a pathway to permanent housing, empowering those in need to provide their families with safe, secure, and affordable homes. Families like Voltaire and Medelia Blanc, who lost the home they shared with their two young sons and niece.
With their new habitat transitional shelter, they will be better protected in the event of a flood. Though it only takes a moment to destroy, a country takes time to rebuild. In addition to our disaster response and rebuilding efforts, Habitat's annual Jimmy and Rosalind Carter Work Project will be building homes and communities in 2011, and then again in 2012. Our efforts and success depend on you. So I invite everyone to build back better this country and to transform it into a paradise.